Late in 2013, Doug Carlisle believes he's found a financial savior in a big money Saudi Arabian investor. They believe that this Saudi Arabian uh, oil tycoon was gonna invest in them, give them the money to build all the wells. Well, it turned out he's a con man. Before they can do business, the Saudi investor asks for collateral to help establish their relationship. So he asked for approximately $80,000 from Mr. Carlisle, which Mr. Carlisle did supply. They ended up giving him a large sum of money that he walked away with. Hendrickson is furious with Carlisle. Their chance at a fortune is slowly slipping away. The oil drilling just wasn't getting started, and the timing of the lease was limited. The men's relationship deteriorates. He had actually tried to buy Doug out of his, his uh, percentage of their business together. Um, but Doug wasn't going to leave. You know, I think they all saw this pot of gold at the end. Um, and so no one wanted to leave. Carlisle's wife says her husband is increasingly worried. Alberta Carlisle had noted that Mr. Carlisle would walk around the house, make sure all the windows were locked. She had noted that he had never done that in the past. An all-new American Greed, Mondays, 10 Eastern, CNBC. Get yours. Hey, CNBC fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you'll find videos from all your favorite CNBC shows. Be sure to subscribe by clicking right here. Click on the videos around me and watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.